right, here we go. Let's play ball. And he gets down to bunt, pops it up in the air, quick out. Good adjustment by Braden. He was charging to get the bunt, but the bunt skied as a pop fly. The dugout for Bay Area is a very loud dugout. Brighton right down the middle. Strike one. Got a hit on it, but it looks like Will Leakey is making a play for it, and he's got it out in right field. Two quick outs. The good part about this is Braden has only thrown three pitches, I think. And so if he can get out of the inning throwing three to five pitches, man, that's really, really good. And another strike. Another strike. Braden has thrown nothing but strikes so far. Here's a hit, the shortstop, great play off the hop. Over to Cy for the third out. One, two, three. Great inning for Logos. All right, welcome back. Up to bat first tonight is sophomore Graham Weller. Graham hits a ball, fly. Oh, it gets down. And Graham is going to take two on this and come up easy. Starting off with a double. It's a good start for Logos. Next up to bat is Drew Mason, another sophomore.
didn't quite think that ball was going to land fair, but it did. And it landed about as far away as you can get from the first and the right fielder in a perfect spot, and they couldn't get to it. And so Graham is on second base. Ball one there. Strike one. So the count's one and one for Drew Mason. Drew Mason swing, foul ball. He strike two. Inside, ball two. Good eye by Drew there. 2-2 two, two is the count. Got a runner on second, no outs. Oh, Drew gets a good hit. Caught by the second baseman, Graham. Hurries up and gets back on second. That'll be our first out. Up now is Luke Dawkey. He has had a great senior season. Has a lot of power. Pitching him inside there. We got the wind at our back today, and so I wouldn't be surprised if Luke knocked one out tonight. Ball two. It's the third time we've played Bay Area this season, so they know who our hitters are and they know who Luke is. And with an open first base, I doubt this pitcher is going to serve anything up for him to hit. Luke gets under it a little bit. It's the center field. The center fielder makes a play on it. That's two outs. And Graham is still... Stuck at second. Up now is junior Nolan Bromberg. Another guy with power. It's going to be ball one. Nolan gets one's going to get through. Nope. Shortstop makes a great play on it. Gets him out at first. That's the inning. Logo strands one on second at the bottom of the first ends with the score 0-0. Zero, zero.
right, here we go. Top of the second. Braden only threw five pitches, or six, sorry, six pitches in the first inning, so he hadn't had to work a whole lot. Let's see if we can do that again. A little outside. A little outside again. Ball three outside. This is one of Bay Area's most powerful hitters, so I'm sure Braden is trying to keep anything down the middle. There we go, strike one. The other night, Braden did this a few times. He'd get down 3-0 and come back and and get a strike out. Let's see if we can do it again tonight. Ooh. That one looked really good. So Braden walks the first batter. A little high there on the first pitch. One ball, no strikes. Pop up in the air. Nolan's calling people off. Makes the easy catch. First out of the second inning. Runner on first. Great pitch, strike one foul. Hit out into right field to Will Leakey, a little bit of a overthrow. Max is there to Back it up. Keep the runner on first. Two outs. One on first. That's another hit out into the left field. Oh. Gaten got a glove on it, came up a little bit short. Little Vance, a runner to third. So we got runners on first and third. Great play by freshman Gaten Leakey. Just about three inches short getting the ball. sure what they're questioning here. There was time on the field. Coach and the umpire discussing something. Not quite sure what it is, but it looks like everybody's satisfied with what's going on. They're going to continue to play. A little high and inside. Ball one. High and inside again. For ball two. Pop 
Top fly out of bounds. Going to be completely out of play. That'll bring in strike one. Counts two and one. Two outs. Runners on first and third. Called ball there. So it's three balls, one strike. Second is open, so a walk is not too bad. Long, long hit. Gate in the back, catches it with both hands. Third out. Braden gets out of his jam, and we are still scoreless after the top of the second. And Logos is coming up to bat. All right, here we go. Starting the bottom of the second inning. Up to bat is Braden Tibbetts, freshman who's also pitching tonight. Got strike one there. ball counts one and one I'm saying it's a little bit outside we will take it that one was down the middle Brings count to two and two. Braden gets a good rip on it. Shortstop falls, overthrows it big time. Throws it out of the park. So Braden will automatically get to go to second. So Braden's got an infield single there and then an error to get to second base. So once again, we have a runner on second with no outs, just like we did last inning. Let's see if we can move the runner this time. Up to bat is senior Will Leakey. He's going to go play baseball for the Maritime Academy in Massachusetts um, next year. Going to be an engineer and play some baseball at the same time. He takes strike one. Mm. Will wanted that one. Counts 0-2.
Will rip the third base. It gets through. Braden's unable to take third as he held up. That was a hard hit. With two strikes and no balls, Will did a great job finding a way to get the bat on the ball and get himself to first base. So we've got first and second, no outs. Cy is looking to bunt. Let's see who's up to bat. Cy Bromberg, freshman. His brother Nolan Bromberg batted last inning. Outside. That's two balls, no strikes. Swing and a strike. Two balls, one strike for Cy. Ooh, strike two called. Two and two. Dugout's calling for the size special. I'm not sure what that is. Oh, get back, get back. Oh. Double play on that one. Mm -mm -mm. So there are two outs. Runner on second. Same situation as last time. You got a pitch runner coming in for Braden. We can start to warm up and get ready to pitch. Up the bat is freshman catcher Max Starzik. First pitch to Max, a foul ball, strike one. Ooh, and I think that got that did get Max. That will put him on first base. The umps are now going to discuss whether or not he turned into that pitch, whether he swung or not. And it looks like Max is going to stay on first. And he is running his pads over. And he's going to have a pinch runner, too, as he's the catcher, and he's going to get ready. The catch. So we have two outs, runner on first and second. Up the bat is number six, Gaten Leakey, sophomore left fielder. Ooh. Foul tip. Strike one for Gaten. After Gaten, we'll get the top of our lineup back up. Logos has done a good job of getting base runners on. 
Had a little miscue there on the line drive on the double play. But besides that, they've done a really good job. gaten has got strike two, another foul tip. Just a little on top of the ball. Ball one, catcher mishandles the ball, but runners stay put. Counts one and two. Swing and a strike three. That'll end the second inning. Score zero, zero. We start the third inning with a ball. Ryden got in a little bit of trouble last inning, but did a great job getting out, but no damage. Good hit there. That's going to reach the fence. Gaten's got it. And it's going to be a stand-up double. Just a nice hard hit down the third baseline. So Bay Area's got a runner on second, no outs. That's how Logos has started their first two innings. We are unable to get a runner in. Hopefully, Logos will be able to stop Bay Area from doing the same. Another hit up the middle. This is probably going to bring the run home. He is coming in. There is a, oh, they're able to hold him. So we have runners on third and first, no outs. Max calling time to be able to communicate something to Braden.
but Schoen pulled back, stealing second. They have now runners on second and third. Still no outs. Hit out into left field. Oh, over right fielder's head. It's going to score one. Second is coming in. It's going to score two runs. Still no outs. Hopefully, Braden can settle in here. Oh, pass ball moves the runner to third base. Just needs to breathe and calm down a little bit here. Logos can score a lot of runs, so two runs is not a big deal. There we go. One ball, one strike is the count. Another hit out into right center. They're not going to get to it. Picks it up quick. Going to hold the runner at first, but another run scores. Bringing the score 3 0. No outs. And Coach Bromberg is going to go visit Braden out on the mound and have a chat. All right, the meeting's over. Braden's going to continue pitching for us. I think he just wanted to come out there and just give him a minute to catch his breath, settle down. Nice move to try to get him out at first. A little late. Ball one, a little down and outside. Braden's keeping the guy honest at first. Three balls, no strikes. No outs. Runner on first. Bay Area scored three this inning so far. And ball... F oh... Runner thought that it was ball four, but umpire calls it a strike. I agree with the umpire. That's ball four. So we got runners on first and second, still no outs. Coach Bromberg is going to come back out again. I think that's going to be it for Braden. 
And it looks like Luke Dawkey is going to take his place, which means Braden will move into second base. And senior Luke Dawkey will continue the game pitching. Here we go. Runners on first and second. No outs. Top of the third. Pitching now is Luke Dawkey. Throws it in for ball one. There we go. Strike one. Swing and a miss. Luke Dawkey's definitely going to be one of the players they miss next year. He's going to be going to the University of Arkansas. Strike two. One ball, two strikes. No outs. Runners on first and second. Luke inherited those runners. This is the first batter he's faced tonight. Ooh. Two and two the count. That looked really good. That's inside high. Rent to a full count. Three and two. Strike three. Great pitch by Luke. And that's one out. Runners on first and second. Two 
Come on, Luke. Let's do that one more time. There we go. Strike one. Inside ball. One ball, one strike. There's a hit out. It's going to be, oh, short. Leaky can't quite get to it. One run's going to score. Double, making the score four nothing. Still one out. Runners on second and third. Will was charged on that pretty hard. Right in between that stage of where do you dive or don't dive and let it hop. I don't think it hurt him at all. I think we'd have had a score no matter what. Almost made a great play. Strike one. Lowe's just needs to get out of this inning, reset themselves. Strike two. Logos has had a lot of innings this year where they put up six, seven runs. So a 4-0 lead is not too hard for them to come back on. They've already been on base a lot tonight. A little low. Ball one. One ball, two strikes. A little bit outside for ball two. Counts two and two. Hit. It's going to be out of play. Foul ball. Count remains two and two. One out. Runners on second and third. Four runs so far scored this inning. Count is full. Three and two. Foul tip out of play behind us, shaking up the fans a little bit. We have a great, great crowd tonight. A lot of people out here supporting our Lions. Time is called on the field. All right, here we go again. Full count. Great pitch right down the middle. Batter tried to convince the umpire it wasn't a strike, but he knew it was. All right, now we have two outs.
Takes a little bit of pressure off. Runners at second and third. Let's see if we can get out of this inning without any more damage. Strike one. Ball one, counts one and one. Hmm. Ball two. Three and one. Ball four. That'll be a walk. It'll load up the bases. We have two outs, force on any bag. Base is loaded. It'd be great to get out of this inning. With only four runs. Luke inherited the runner on third, but he is responsible for the runners on first and second. Two balls. There is a long hit, and that is gone. Grand slam home run. That brings the score to eight to nothing. Mm, that was a big hit. Eight run, third inning by Bay Area. It can be tough. The boys are going to need to. They can climb their way back into this. They're just going to need to focus, keep their heads up. Fresh start for Luke. Strike one. Ball a little low. One ball, one strike. Time's called. These boys can definitely come back from this. They do. They just have to keep their heads up. Oh. Just the kind of got away from them. Not sure what happened there. That ball was about 20 feet outside, or inside, on the other side of the pitcher. I don't know if it slipped out of his hand or what.
Two balls, one strike. Another ball inside. There we go. Counts three and two. There is a hit out in the center field. Oh, nope, second base, sorry. Braden Tibbetts gets it, and we are out of this inning. There is a lot of damage done. This Bay Area picks up eight runs in that inning. The Logos has got their work cut out for them. But they can do it. So going to the bottom of the third, eight to nothing. back up to the top of the lineup. Starting out with the ball one. Graham Weller pit, uh, hitting. Singled but reached second on his first at bat due to an error. Two balls, no strike. There's strike one. It's outside, ball three, three and one. No outs. Bottom of the third. Swing and foul tip. Strike two. It's a full count. Inside, ball four. So we got a runner on base, no outs. Drew Mason up to bat. Sophomore here at Logos. Logos doesn't need to try to get all these runs in one hit. Just work their way back into it. Foul tip strike two. 
counts 0 and 2. There's a hit, short stop, gets him at second, safe at first. Good hustle by Drew to beat out the throw. One out, runner on first. Luke Dawkey up the bat. High and over the fence. That's going to get Drew over to second base. Bad pitch. Moves our runner to second. Runner on second, one out. We've been in this situation quite a few times tonight. In fact, all three innings, we've had a runner on second with one or no outs. Have yet to move them around. Called strike there, so it's one and one. Drew taking a pretty big lead. We're not too concerned about him right now. Outside. Ball two. Two and one's the count. Inside. Last time the bat, Luke got hit. That time he was able to get out of the way. Bringing the count to three and one. A little, oh, that's trouble. That's trouble. Third baseman couldn't quite pick it up. Slow roller to the third baseman. Puts a runner on first and third with one out. Brings up Nolan Bromberg. Let's see if we can get a run in here. Strike one. Nolan just a little bit behind that ball, a little late swinging. Foul tip strike two. Counts 0 and 2. Ball one. Got a hit up the middle. That's going to score Drew Mason. Move Dawkey over to second. That's exactly what we needed. Logos is now on the board.
ball inside. Braden Tibbetts up the bat. A little high, ball two. Oh, great hit. Great hit. We're not going to be able to get anybody home. But he rips it down the third baseline. Loads up the bases. One out. Up the bat is Will Leakey. Time is being called. As the coach wants to have a talk with his pitcher. Ball one and now strike one by Dalkey. So it counts one and one. We're still trying to fix our feed. Sorry about that. Ball two. All right, welcome back. We had some overheating issues, and so now we are stuck with this view, and I know it's kind of hard to see through the fence. But we are now in the bottom of the fourth. And there are no outs. And we have a runner on first. called strike three so that's one out runner on first foul ball out of play Called strike. We're still having a problem with our scoreboard and stuff. So, truth is, the kids that are so good at doing this are actually playing in the game today. So, as an old adult, I'm up here trying to figure out all the amazing things that they've done with this. And it's not as easy as it looks. But, oh, I think I got us going again. Bottom of the fourth. Eight to one. 
struck him out for the second out. There's two outs. We have a runner on first. Timeout called. We're going to get a pinch runner in. Got Drew Mason up the bat. Called strike one. One strike, one ball. Strike two, swing in there. Two outs, runner on first. Ball two. Foul ball out of place. Count still two and two. We got a hit out the center field. Makes the play. That is three outs. And we are going to the top of the fifth. Score remains eight to one. All right, Luke Dawkey back out.
pitching the top of the fifth. Ball one. Strike one. Two balls, one strike. That's the count. Little hit to third base. Nolan picks it up fast, flips it on over there for one out. Good rip out in the left field. That's going to be a base hit. He's going to try to run to second. It's taking a little time to get the ball in, and he's going to make it. One out, runner on second. That's a single followed up by an error. Logos has played a great game except for one inning. That third inning, Bay Area scored all their runs. Logos has kept them scoreless every other inning. But it was a big inning. It's been a long hill to climb back from. And Logos just hasn't gotten their bats going yet. Ball one. Hot fly, deep center field, off the wall. Graham gets it in quick. There's going to be a play at home, but it's going to be too late. Runner's going to score. One out double. Score is now nine to one at the top of the fifth. And it looks like we're going to make another pitching change. Cy Bromberg, freshman, warming up the pitch.
All right, well, we're in the top of the fifth. Scores nine to one. One out, runner on second. Cy Bromberg is now pitching. Starts the count with the ball outside. Second pitch is a little low for ball two. Low and outside, ball three. Counts three and oh. And high for ball four. So there's now a runner on first and second with one out. Low, ball one. There we go. Down the middle, strike one. It's a big stage for a freshman come in and pitch. Side's doing a good job of settling in now. Strike two. There he goes. Sometimes just takes a, a couple pitches for them to settle in and, and get going in the game. One ball, two strikes is the count. Low ball two. That was a great stop by Max Starzik there. Oop, there's a rip out into left field. That ball is down. One runner is going to score. It is a one out double. Making the score 10 to 1. Runners on second and third. One out. Still in the top of the fifth. Outside, ball one. That looked pretty good. Of course, the ump has been calling a great game so far. and He's got a lot better view than I do, so... Mm, just outside. Ball three. The count's three and oh. Runners on second and third. There we go. 3 0 strike by Cy. Good pitch there.
Tying outside for ball four. That will load up the bases and bring out Coach Bromberg with two mitts in his hands. Meaning that that will probably be the end for Cy. Yep, Cy's taking his first base min mitt back. Luke Dawkey is taking his second base mitt back. And Cy's big brother, Nolan, it looks like he's going to be taking the mound here. Try to get us out of the fifth inning with one out. One strike, one ball for Nolan Bromberg. There's a hit, gets through, shortstop. That is going to score another run. That makes the score 11 to 1. One out. Sorry, they scored two runs there. It makes the score 12 to 1. Still one out in the inning. Two balls, no strikes. Really do apologize for all the hiccups tonight with the video feed. Pop fly into center field. Easy catch there. The runner no, doesn't tag up. Holds him at first and second. Two outs. Sorry for the hiccups. We are 
broadcasting outside for the first time in heat. And so we had a lot of stuff overheat tonight and um, got to figure out a solution to that. But that's why we are doing these beta testing before we go live and public. Ball one. Our teenagers actually do a phenomenal job streaming. They are actually a lot better at troubleshooting than I am. I'm by myself tonight, commentating and trying to do everything else. And so I am not near as talented as our teenagers are at this. So I'm sure if they were behind the controls, things would have been a lot smoother tonight. Pass ball, the runners advance. Putting runners at second and third. We have two balls and one strike. We are at two outs. There is a hit in the center field. Good catch. That gets us out of the inning. But the score is 12 to 1. And by rule, if Logos does not score at least two runs at the bottom of this inning, the game will end as there is a mercy rule of 10 plus run lead after five full innings. So Logos will need to come in and score at least two runs this inning for the game to continue on. Starting off for the fifth is senior Luke Dawkey. New pitcher for Bay Area. Strike one. He has really good speed. Strike two, working the outside of that plate. It's going to be high for ball one. Counts one and two. Foul ball out of play. Luke gets his bat out on it. K 
count still one and two. Luke gets it, ground ball to third. Third baseman picks it up. Oh, missed at first base. Error by the first baseman is to our advantage as Luke is going to be safe at first. So no outs. We got a runner on first. Up the bat is Nolan Bromberg. Takes ball one. Takes ball two. Swing and a strike. Strike one. That's two balls, one strike. Strike two. And this pitcher is throwing the ball significantly harder than their first pitcher, and that is sometimes hard to, to change your swing. Nolan's a little bit behind it. Gets a piece of it there. Two balls, two strikes. Dockey on first. Ball three, high and outside. So we have a full count, no outs. Bottom of the fifth. Logo must score twice this inning to keep the game going. Nolan hangs in there, fouls it behind us. Stands yelling heads up, keeping everybody aware of what's going on. We got a bunch of little kids playing out back there. Mom and dad come to watch the game. The kids come to play. Ooh, that hurts. But it gets us with runners on first and second and no outs. Like I said, this guy throws the ball hard. So, and that hit Nolan right in the kidney, it looked like. And so that had to not feel good. That was me that got hit. I would still be on the ground. They'd have to cart me off. But Nolan's a tough kid. Braden just a little bit below that one. Gets a little piece of it. Strike one.
nice breaking ball. Looked like it was going to come inside at the very end. Just broke right into the catcher's mitt right over the plate. Strike two. 0 oh and 2 is the count. Braden knew it the second it hit. Great pitch. Leads to our first out. So we got one out. We got two on base. We got Will Leakey up to bat. First pitch called ball one high. Foul tip behind us. Strike one, making the count one and one. Inside and high. Ball two. Counts two and one for Will. Inside ball three, counts three and one. Catcher fumbled it a little bit, but Logos didn't advance. Really no need to. They need a lot of runs, so no sense in taking any chances right now. Good swing to stay in the count. Three and two. One out, runners on first and second. Struck him out. That's two outs. And this is the last chance for Logos here. They need to score two runs in this inning to keep the game going. We got runners on first and second, two outs. Strike one. comes the pitch. Cy hits a blooper that might. Everybody's safe. Everybody's safe. Hits a little dribbler. Made it hard for anybody to get to it. Loads up the bases. Good job getting the bat on the ball. Brings up Max. Catcher tonight. Swing and a strike one. Outside ball one. Counts one and one. Bases are loaded. Two outs. Logos needs to score two runs here to stay in the game. Otherwise, it will be called after this inning. Strike two. 
Two strikes, one ball. For Max. Ooh. A little high. A little outside. Two and two. Strike three, and that should be the ball game. And I believe it is, unless I am wrong with the rules. But nope, I am not. That is the ball game. Logos goes down 12 to 1. They were just not having it tonight. Um, they have played this team very well all year. They have played well all year. They just, rough third inning. And a hard loss for Logos. We have one more game next Tuesday in district. So uh, hopefully we'll be back in.